So we get asked all the time, what, uh, what got us involved in ghost hunting, and uh, we've always been interested in the paranormal, so we figured we're going to start a series. Okay, so this is our pilot episode of Malligators Go Ghost Hunting, and um, yeah, um, I think you'll enjoy it. Um, we already got cancelled. <laughs> before we even got started, so I don't know what the problem was. I think it had a lot to do with our editor, but um, uh, just just go ahead and watch and, uh, uh, and enjoy. Maybe like and subscribe if you're new to the channel. Yeah. Okay, so today on Monkey and Meds King, we're going out to the Northwest and we are going to do a little ghost hunting. So, uh, Stay tuned, and we'll go have an interview. Uh, yeah, I'm glad you guys came, because it's been pretty scary around here. we got a lot of things going on, and uh, I'm just glad you guys are here to help us out. Okay, so just to hide his in and out of any mini minis, we uh, went ahead and uh, changed his voice. We darkened his and put him in the shadows so people couldn't identify him and stuff like that. And, uh, yeah, it's just to hide his epidemic and in Yeah, so this is what I started about a month after we moved in, started hearing noises, the sound of the moving, and hearing the kids playing around. So, uh, what we're gonna do now is we're gonna get Justin to go ahead and give us a tour of his place. Um, we went ahead and changed his voice, and kind of made him sound a little more like a ghost. So, uh, we went ahead and changed his voice, and kind of, you know, darkened him out so people wouldn't know who he was by his voice or, you know, what he looked like before we edit. But, um, he's an idiot because we're inside his house and, um, if he has any friends or family, they know where you live. So they know who you are. I don't see why we have to waste the time to do this stuff. This is so stupid. So, this is the, uh, kitchen, and, uh, that sound of it, it just starts moving for no reason. It's, uh, it's kind of weird how it just starts swinging back and forth. <laughs> so, anyway, Justin's giving the tour to the rest of the dogs. Look at this. It's scary at the chandelier. It's really back and forth. Yeah. What a joke. Okay, so we're getting closer to, uh, starting our uh, investigation, but we're going to start here in the kitchen first. It's uh, one, of the, one of the hot spots, supposedly the chandelier moves on its own. Um, probably going to have you, Mezzikeen, um, probably have you check that area out. Monkey, I'll have you check back area, and uh, I'll just wait outside while you guys do this, because um, there's supposedly ghosts. So, yeah. So, uh, if you go back here in the bathroom, um, for some reason, this, uh, the sink will turn on for no reason, and the water just start pouring, and, um, that's usually like about 2.30, 3 o'clock in the morning, and I come in here, and, like, the whole place is just totally steamed up, and, yeah, it's, it's kind of freaking us out. Okay, so, um, Justin's still giving a tour of the house with the dogs, and um, we're gonna sneak into the bathroom. Why he brought us into the bathroom in the dark? It's kind of like, you must not be able to afford his pill. Um, check it out. Check this out. Shh, keep it quiet. It's the haunted sink. So the ghost is washing his hands, big deal. Why not? He's using the toilet too. It's so stupid, I can't believe this channel is actually paying us to do ghost hunting when ghosts aren't even real. <laughs> Tate, don't forget to edit this. We don't want this to air. We'll get in big trouble. So back in this area is where the old school classroom was, and um, it's just like really super cold back here in this area all the time, and um, we just don't know what it is, and um, all the vents work and everything, so it's just kind of really weird that, you know, it would be that cold back this part of the house. 
And then also back here, since this is your classroom, um, I hear a lot of children. Is that a kid's voice? That was, that was a kid's voice, right? Mikey, um, did you hear that? Did you hear that voice? Um, yeah, that was kind of weird. So we're gonna definitely check this area out. Um, I'll probably be back here, and uh, we'll let the dogs uh, go ahead and cover the rest of the house. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna step outside for a second because that was just crazy. Um, there was like a little kid laughing or something like that. I can't believe this. Maybe this is gonna be cracked up to be something awesome. Um, dang, don't forget to edit this part too. <laughs> You're really gonna be busy with all this editing. So, um, that was freaky. Uh, these doors here will just pop open for no in particular reason. Um, that's usually almost any time of day or night. Okay, so we heard the kids laughing in the schoolroom, but, um, come on, seriously, uh, you're gonna tell me that the, um, that the, um, the, um, doors are gonna open by themselves? Um, no. But what if the wind blows and blows it open? That's probably what's happening. They're just not laughing. it. Magic King, can you open it? See, yeah, debunk. Okay, so Tank is our uh, sound guy, so we'll probably have him back here by the door checking it out tonight. Um, that's okay with you guys. Alright, okay. So, yeah, we'll get on that. Um, Tank, that'll be your spot for tonight. And then, um, yeah. Okay, then the last area is probably this. Um, this is the furnace area. Um, yeah, it is... Uh, it makes a lot of noise for uh, a new furnace, so um, I'm not really sure. Um, at one time, this was supposed to be the breathing room, but it's awful small, so um, you know that that's another place we hear a lot of sounds. So, um, Mezzy King said that she heard something coming from this uh, closet thing, so let's check it out. This is really, really strange because we haven't even started anything, so. We're just gonna check out this closet that Mezzikin said that there's something going on in it, so we're gonna check that. What the heck was that? Can you hear that? It's coming from this room. It's almost like, it's almost like this thing is running. Yeah, that's it. That's their problem. It's just running. Um, this thing isn't secured good enough, so yeah, debunked. Okay, so Ms. Keeney and Monkey are getting things set up right now. Um, they're starting here in the kitchen, so they're going to get some stuff set up real quick. <laughs> so, um, Ms. Keeney's, uh, trying to tell me something. What the heck? What the heck? No way! Did you guys do that? I mean, seriously, come on. There is no way. We haven't even got set up yet, and this is going on. Oh, this is going to be a crazy night. Look at that. Okay, so I've been sitting in the, what used to be the old classroom, and I've been hearing a lot of... <laughs> That's children laughing. This is so weird. As you can tell by the time, it's not even time, really, for us to even start hooking up. We still have the lights on, and... So anyway, I've been sitting here by myself. Monkey just came to get me. What is it, Monkey? Show me what you're gonna tell me. What was it? What? Oh, the bathroom? What the heck is going on? Did you do that? Did you do it? No? That is so weird. Ow, son of a gun, that's hot. What the heck is going on around here? There's something in the bathroom. What is going on? Something just touched me. Something just touched me. I'm not kidding. This is getting stupid. I just got touched. What was that? What? In the kitchen? What? We were just in the kitchen not too long ago. What's going on? 
What? Are you kidding? What the heck? Yeah, I think I do hear kids. I don't know what's going on. Okay, so um, me and the dogs are like totally freaked out. We haven't even started an investigation. Things are going on. There's those kids again. We're getting out of here. We're leaving. We're done. We're not even going to do this. These people are on their own. Sorry, but um, ghosts or no ghosts, we're out of here. We're not priestesses. So we're out of here. Let's go. Um, so me and the dogs took off. Um, we weren't going to stay in that place one second longer. I'm, um, um, if I was to say anything, yes. Yes, definitely that place is haunted. Um, uh, we didn't even, it didn't even get dark out. And we had so much activity and um, it just wasn't worth it. Um, we've had too many things attached to us after we've done these investigations and this one is just one that we just didn't want so uh we we beat feet and got out of there so anyway um for the malligator ghost hunters um that was our first and last episode um we'll probably never do that again that's pretty scary and um, you know i think we'll just stick to other things um yeah this this is just crazy um we're not doing this again um yeah no and like always, um, have a great day. Um, ghosts are real. I mean, they're really real. So don't play with those. And um, also, have a great day. And uh, remember to always, always, always take care of your pets. <laughs> Bye.